Hi, this is Andrew with PandaComputers.com and welcome to a quick tip video. I'm going to be using this older machine with Windows XP and I want to explain a little bit more about toolbars. Now there's two different types of toolbars that we're talking about. Let me go ahead and pull up my uh, Firefox here and I'll talk to you about the first type of toolbar. The first type is the Google toolbar which is up here. Now if you go to Internet Basics and look through our videos or through our video section, I'll talk about these toolbars here and what they are. Sometimes there's a Bing bar, a Microsoft bar, a Facebook bar. There's several different kinds of toolbars and you can have three or four of them here in your browser. This video is about the basic toolbars. What I mean is these up here. These are also toolbars and they're what's called program toolbars. The toolbars here are your back button, your front button. All this bar here, a separate bar here is called the menu bar. And then down over here there can be other types of bars. Okay. Now let me go ahead and uh, minimize this for a second and let me pull up Word. Okay. And Word has all kinds of toolbars. Every one of these little things here is a toolbar. When we click on view here, we look at the view. We can turn the toolbars off. Like if I want this ruler turned off, I turn it off. Toolbars are something that help us to be able to quickly go and connect to different functions within the program. Okay. The most common functions are out here by icons, and here's all a bunch more for this part. Page layout, here's a bunch more. Now, if we had just a big list here of all these different options, it would be hard to find. By creating a toolbar here and putting an icon, we can see things. For instance, page borders, it gives us a pictures. Watermark gives us a pictures. Page color shows a little paint can. Almost every program made has some kind of toolbar that helps you interact with that program. Now, sometimes these can be modified, sometimes they cannot. Okay? Sometimes you can view and not view. On pe uh, desktop publishing programs like Word, you can't really change them or delete too much. On other ones like uh, Paint Shop Pro, you can activate and deactivate certain types of toolbars. Okay? So, real quickly, program toolbars, that's what they are. Have a great day.